Mr. and Mrs. Minecraft. Um, I was just doing this quick little section here and it'll be joined up to another video soon. Uh, I'm just chopping down some trees because I'm currently working on a build and these trees are all massive. Um, so I thought I'd just give you a little update on what I'm doing so you can see the start of what I'm, I'm building and then once it's all done you'll be able to see it all together. So I've decided where we've spawned and where we're doing all of our caving and everything else. Um, it's a pretty nice area. It's got a big ocean biome that's right in front of us. So Hubby and I were talking and uh, one of the things I've decided I'm going to build is like a docking port. So I need heaps more wood though because I'm running out of planks and sticks to make fences and all that sort of stuff. Um, so as I said what I'm going to do is build a little port area um, and we're going to mould the land a little bit around just to shape it around and and uh, make it a bit bigger but the plan is, oh apple, the plan is it's a huge ocean biome here and we're set up right over there so we're looking at having a docking port here so you know not that ships are going to come in but have it set up so it looks like the ships will come in through this way and then this will lead over to a massive port area. Um, so let me take you over into the water. Um, we've got our death counter on as well and I've already died once and for, for once it wasn't actually my fault. It was my husband's. He killed me. We were down caving and uh, there was, what do they call them, like silverfish or something? Yeah, you're not sorry. Um, there were like these silverfish blocks and I was knocking them and one of them jumped out and originally I was down to one and a half hearts so I quickly bailed out of there and was jumping upstairs and then hubby decided to come down and be all heroic and try and kill it for me um, and hit me pretty much with his sword and just knocked me straight down. Dead, dead, dead. So I'm so disappointed because I was actually doing not too bad considering how bad I am. Um, but this area here, I'll show you guys. Let me go up a bit higher if I can jump. So this is where we're set up at the moment. Just in here, a tiny little cave area. Oh good, that's cooking. Um, so the idea is this is just the start of the port. So it comes out this way and then it's going to go along all the way down here. And there's going to be like a little fishing dock area and then there's going to be sections along the side for where our boats quote unquote will come in so that's the first build i was trying to actually build you can see like a huge stack of dirt up here i was trying to actually build um like a house area inside um up the top in the mountain but it was just looking really ridiculous like trying to connect that to this area here it was too high up so I've decided to go ahead with all of this. Um, in the next section of video, hopefully I'll have it all done or most of it done and I'll come back and show you guys what it's looking like. Um, but, ooh, that was close. Um, but look, I'd love your feedback in terms of how you, how you think it's gonna look. Um, as I said, this part of the video will be joined up with it, hopefully when it's all done. And uh, yeah, so I will be back when it's built. All right, welcome back guys. I'm just finishing this last little bit off and I think we're almost done. I'll show you what it looks like first. Mm, I need to get somewhere where I can see it really well actually. Oh well, you can see it from here. It looks quite odd because it's a fair distance away but let me get up high. <laughs> that was smart. Let me get up high for you guys and show you what it looks like. Actually, I did make some boats. So, just to give it a nice little aesthetic feel. Chuck a boat in, good work. And I made two more. All right, so. <laughs> no, 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 come back. <laughs> Are you going to stay? Ugh. In a little bit more. In a little bit more. Stop. Stop. Yeah, that's good. 
Where are you? No. <laughs> I hate these boats. They're so annoying. All right. Stop. Just tap it in. Just tap, tap it in. Oh, that didn't work either, did it? Yes, good. Oh, it's turning into night. I really need to get up higher. Um, there we go. Got some nice boats going. So let's get a little bit higher so you can see the whole thing all together. I'm pretty stoked with it. Um, it's not massive, like in terms of um, scale kind of, keeping it all to scale kind of thing. Um, but it's quite big for the area that we're going to have. So, ta-da! Looks pretty good, I reckon. So you can see you've got the pathway down, rolls around this way. You've got your three boats in there. It's a little docking port there. And if you keep going further down, you'll see down the end there, you've got like a little fishing area. Um, so, and I put a chest there, like a double chest, because I thought when we're, oh, that's probably a bit high. Oh, that's probably a bit high too. Um, when we want to do fishing, like to get some raw food and stuff like that, you'd rather than have it stored in the house and take it along with you, you can just come straight here and it's all stored there. So you can put fish in there if you want to. Um, so this is all just oak wood planks and then this is stone. So you pick off your cobblestone. Uh, we caved a whole lot in the mountain where we're currently set up and uh, just cooked it to get the stone. And then these are stone slabs just with some fences. I was thinking of doing like glowstone over the top for like a hanging light, but it just didn't really suit the style of this. So, mm, hungry. Uh, so I thought I'd throw some torches around. I'm not sure about this here and the torches at the end, but at the moment I need to keep it, ooh, skelly. I need to keep it, keep it lit up pretty well um, at night for spawners and all that not to arrive. So, this is the double chest here. Oh, Hubby's already put the fishing rod and some fish in there. So, I reckon it's pretty nice. It's a good little area. Uh, as I said, I don't want to get too close to stuff. So, you can stand out here, throw it in, have a fish. And then when we want to go adventuring, all that sort of stuff, we can just grab a boat. These were originally posts to, like, you know, lead it on, leash the boat on. But... As Hubby said, you can we can ride a horse down here, tie the horse on, and go on our boat. So you've got that option too. Um, but yeah, it's nice and open. Keeps the space looking big still, like it's not this huge roofed thing that's going to take up tons of space. So yeah, I'm pretty stoked with it. it looks looks good. Nice and light. Um, I haven't put like stone posts all the way down to the ground, so it kind of looks like a floating. Um, bay port thing whatever at the moment but um what i will do eventually is put these all the way down but it is really really deep like as soon as you jump in and it gets really really dark too so it's actually fairly deep the water's here and it gets deeper in certain areas too so that's why i haven't done it yet i'd like to get a helmet with um Oh, I don't know what it's called, but it's the one where you can aqua affinity where you can breathe underwater for a bit longer That would be good. But until then, I don't know. We'll just leave it as it is until Hubby says do it. So the next project I'm looking at doing is building like Along here, you know how like if you're going to you go down to the bay and you'll have a nice little restaurant on the side not that I'm building a restaurant but right on the water you'll have like a building and it'll have a patio sort of area that's what I'm planning to build next um, and I wanted to put it here so it's still fairly close to the port um, but it's not too high because I was originally going to build right up there which I might later I'm not sure yet I've got to figure a few things out first with supplies and how it's exactly going to work but um, there's nothing around no so what I'm thinking of doing is building something in here, just like a room. And then I've grabbed a whole lot of supplies. So we've got some spruce wood planks and we've uh, planted a few of those trees. I've also sheared off a whole lot of leaves. So um, I've grabbed some oak, some spruce, some birch, which I'll go back up to the house area and I'll show you what I've got. Um, oh, if you can hear that, we have a portal. 
We're off to the nether, the wonderful nether of... I have no idea. So, oak leaves, birch leaves, spruce leaves. So, what I'm thinking of doing um, is... Where's my fences as well? I'm going to build, like, a big open room. So, it's not necessarily a house. It's just a big outdoor sort of area. But it's going to be covered and lit up okay. Um, so, things don't spawn in there. Well, we can hope they don't anyway. Um, and put that just sort of in this area here, like standing out a little bit from the water, but not too much because you don't want it to look too heavy. So that's the next project build. So I've got all my supplies going and I've got some grey stained glass as well, some panes. Um, so I've got this idea in my head and let's hope it all works out because I do like to play in creative first and get it all right. Uh, this is why I don't like doing it in real world because you have like creepers and you can't just fly straight up in the air. The amount of times I've pressed double space to try and get up and it just doesn't work. So, and especially because we're playing on hard and no regen. So you're dead, you're dead, that's it. You lose your stuff, you've got to go back and grab it before anything else happens and, you know, too stressful for me. But um, I'm going to get started on this project soon enough. I've just got to measure it up because I'm not really sure... I'm thinking, see, double jumping again, because I'm an idiot. I'm thinking of sort of going out here, like this sort of distance. Like, not that that's going to stay there. I'm looking at that. I don't think it's too close to the port. I'm not really sure. But, yeah, we'll give it a shot. So, that's my next project. I will keep you guys up to date with everything, but hopefully you enjoy this little build I've done here for the port. Give me a like, give me a comment if you've got any ideas of anything else I should add or if I should have done something differently. Um, love to hear from you guys and I hope you like this series. It's gonna be pretty fun. We've got a lot of different things planned. So um, there'll be some more videos coming out shortly. All right guys, I'll see you again soon.